Dave Microwaves Games has updated Bongo Schmoglo once again on his Patreon. He has added color mode, he has added endless mode, and he has made his fat hitbox not so fat, so the game should be easier, right? Probably. So we're going to jump right in and play through normal. I know endless is the new thing. Um, also, there are new enemies in the game, apparently. Uh, so we should be able to go to the options and change it to color mode. Yeah. So I just want to see if color mode's easier. If it's easier to spot Bongo. Oh, yeah. I assume it is. Um, I'm just going. We're just going with it. I mean, it might still be a pain in the ass. I feel like you still have to play the game about the same. <clears throat> Just kind of assume he's going where he's going and hope he doesn't turn back on you quickly. I know we just revisited this game not long ago, but it's nice to see the game in color. Um, it looks really good. Like, this shader looks really good in Dave games. I'm feeling it. But yeah, Bongo Schmoggle is a pretty a short, simple game. So this video might not be that long. It really depends. Um, I'm just gonna play through normal mode and then play endless mode, and if we have time, then I'll play hardcore, but... Most likely just gonna do normal and endless. <coughs> I'm still sick, <clears throat> by the way, so regular videos are still kinda... Few and far between... Here on the Jayski Bean channel. I don't know where he is. Yeah, he's over there. So basically, from here... We just wait on him to come all the way around and go that way. And we go the other way. Yep, he's gone. He might be coming back. But either way, we run in here. There's nothing in there. I don't see anything in there. There's one here, and there's probably one in this room over here. Yep. Nice. Now if we can just get back to the edge room. At the edge. Of course, I don't know where he is. All right, we should be straight now. Should be safe. Just wait for him to pass. And then we just run. There's Bongo. Oh, he's going that way. Nope. Yeah, that's a trap. Yep, and he went back and he went in that room. Let's wait for him to come out. What's he doing? What you doing, man? All the way? Yep. Please go all the way. Don't turn around. He sees forever. But it looks like we're good. Looks like that's like that's like the perfect run right there. <laughs> Super easy. Bongo Schmoglo in three minutes. Done. <coughs> Thank you. Ah oh, man, I hate being sick. I'm so ready for this to be over. All right, so now let's check out endless mode. This is why you're all here. This one apparently has a different enemy. Um, in comparison to the main mode. Um, I don't know how different the enemy is. It's just Bongo. Holy Jesus! Oh, that's open! Um, alright, so, uh, 100%, oh my god. Uh, being real with you, the, the secret enemy or the extra enemy or whatever is supposed to be like mini bongos. Yo, he's just right. That is, that is not a mini bongo. That's a regular size bongo. Hate to break it to you. So he's got a shortcut that he can use then. To get straight through the map. Which is not the best. Not the coolest, if you ask me. So I wonder how the respawning works. <clears throat> Do you have to, uh... Collect all of them for it to respawn? <clears throat> oh, this connects. Oh, that's the exit right there. Damn. Okay. He's to the right. Sounds like he's going away. Oh, no, he's coming. Yeah. Don't come in here. He's going away. It's weird. So much of the map is open up, opened up now. What the hell is that? Has that always been there? The hole in the ceiling? 
Who knows? It might be a spawn point. The uh, I heard there were baby bongos, tiny bongos, little bongo fellers. Where are they? I don't. I don't want it. I don't want it. What was that? I can't go this way. What's this? There was like a blocking volume there. That's a mini bongo. If I've ever seen it. Am I good though? I can outrun them. It's good to know. So there's a bunch of mini bongos. Nice. Nine. I got nine. It's my new record. You know, that, that works. That's basically like beating the main game. Let's try, uh... <clears throat> Let's try hard difficulty. Now, I am not... Probably not going to beat this, but, you know, let's, let's give it a shot. Let's give the old college a try. It's real dark. It's definitely darker. Oh, yeah. That open map is just a lot harder to get used to. So you have to, like, relearn everything. Oh, he's just faster. Probably just go. Oh, Jesus, he's quiet. He's really quiet. Wow. So does he go into like? I don't like how the color mode doesn't transfer when you die. <laughs> you have to set the color mode every time you hit a new attempt, which is going to be a lot in um in this mode. So don't expect me to beat. I I don't have time for this. You know what? Maybe I do. I just looked at the time. We've been playing for six minutes. <laughs> Maybe I should beat this in color. Let's see what the ending looks like in colored mode. For hard. Get it. I don't even know where he came from. I don't even know where he where he was. He just kills you. He's so fast. This is all about stealth. Yeah. Don't get seen. Even though he'll spawn. Where is he? I think he's behind me now. Yeah. Am I good to go? Can I go? I'm going. I want to check this room and get out of it because this room's a trap. <clears throat> he's just sprinting around the map too, so it's like, it's really tough. You got to find your way through. Should be like little checkpoint hiding spots you can you can hang out at. There is leaning. Do you go straight or do you go left? I can't tell. <coughs> the thing is, I don't want to follow him and him double back on me. <clears throat> so hopefully that's not what's happening right now. That's six. The last two are probably down the other hall. Yeah. Which means I don't I don't know how I'm gonna get out of this. I think the rest of this this requires some YOLO. Or some following him out. And hoping he goes all the way to the other side. Because I can work with the double doors on the other side of the map. And wait in that closet. Also, when you die, you start all over. And and the colorfulness goes away, so that's fun. Oh, man. Bongo Schmoglo. What would we do without you? Uh, what would we do, Morty? Nothing. We wouldn't do anything without Bongo Schmoglo. <coughs> Sorry, I'm dying. Everybody needs a little bit of Bongo in their life. I'm just going to yellow it. He happened to be in the one spot where it would, uh, I, that YOLO would kill me. All right, so um, we don't want to get caught there. <clears throat> you don't want to get stuck there. That's a bad spot to be. Oh, Got it. Man. Just Padre with a banana on his face. Probably about to die. I don't know where he is, dude. Where is Bongo? 
<clears throat> Bongo? There's a banana down there. Okay, he's over there. Dude. What are you- where are you going? Okay. Hopefully he doesn't turn right back around. Alright, so the plan. There's no banana, okay. Oh. Go, 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 go. Yeah. Right here is good. We just wait for Bongo. We go up this hall and then come right back. And we're in the same spot we were in. <laughs> Except we're not stuck. So we have to double back and come back to the cap or the the library. <clears throat> it's a cafeteria. Bongo Schmaglo, baby. I'm sorry I'm so like unenthusiastic in my videos lately. I'm just uh, I'm so sick and I'm so tired. <clears throat> I'm just trying to shake this shit off. I feel like I'm at the end of it. I feel like I'm so close. I just, you know, it's still there. It's, this, it's a sinus infection. It's just lingering. And it's, oh, I'm coughing so much. My head is always in pain. It's the worst. It is. It makes working way harder. Oh, man. It's, it's rough, dude. It's big rough. And I can't really, I haven't really done anything. I've been sick for a whole week. This is like day seven or day eight. Bongo, dude. No, you're not coming? I'm going. Probably going to die. Because his, his AI, his patrol is completely 100,000% random. So like if we go, we just we just risk it a hundred percent. Damn! Almost got through. Almost got through. My my butt was my butt cheeks were sticking out into the hallway there. If it if it weren't for that, <clears throat> we would have made it. Damn. Mm, good. That's crazy. So there's a banana there. There's Bongo. Is he coming back? Probably, right? There's Imurai. Alright, there's one there. Is he gonna come down this hall? <laughs> My voice. <laughs> I think I just go. I don't think there's a point really in waiting. I think you just go for it. Every time. I think I think this game requires the YOLO strats. It's one of those if you die, you die kind of games. Damn. I should have just stayed in the room. There was a chance he wasn't going to come in that room. I was just thinking he's going to come in that room. So I got out of that room. So I think going to the right side first is a good idea. Although getting back to the start is difficult. Alright, where's he at? Oh, can I get the banana through the wall? No. So he uses um, hitboxes for the UI. And um, <clears throat> line tracing for actual picking it up. <coughs> that makes sense. Uh, unless I'm completely wrong. How was I supposed to know he was down? I saw him wiggling around over there. I assume he just got through really, really quickly, and I didn't realize. But maybe not. It's not what happened at all. God, dude. Okay. I'm in my little corner. Waiting to hear these footsteps. Which we won't hear until he's right against the wall. Okay, here he comes. We're going for it. I don't know where he's going. 
No banana. No banana. Banana. Okay. Oh, yeah. Bongo, you coming? <clears throat> I can wait for him to come and then go, and then I can go behind him. But then there's a chance he'll come right back around. Either way, it's risky, dude. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. Um. I didn't know he came in this room. So now we know that he goes into that room. That's something that I did not, I was not aware of. I feel like Bongo has a patrol point in every room in the house. It's the lanky lonky kind of situation. Is he this way? Yep. Does he always spawn that way though? Can I just grab these two uh, bananas and then go the other direction? No, of course I gotta grab the bananas. Was there one in the main room I missed? Yeah. Well, I'm f I'm fucked now. I'm mega fucked now. It's too dark. I can't see anything. Bongo, buddy, watch. Okay, never mind. I don't know where he is. Okay, he's coming up that way. He went in there. We go up here. We check room one. Oh, yeah. Get banana. Let me in. Okay. I'm just big chilling. <clears throat> Make sure if he, he swings by and opens the door, I can just close it right back. I see you, Bongo. He's about to come up. Yep, there he is. Yep, there he is. Now, on his way back, he'll most likely open one of these doors. He did not. Okay. We got a YOLO. We got a YOLO. I mean, it's like, it's insightful YOLOing. Like, you you have to have a little, there's a little bit of risk that needs to be taken. Like, right here, there's nothing I can do if he sees me. Oh, man. Okay. That's something I didn't know. The door blocks his vision. Nice, dude. Nice. Is he, is he too fast for me to, like, use the door to get out, though? Like, if he goes this way? Huh. Makes me wonder, like, would I have time to go to the other side of the map? So I guess we just wait. Wait for him to come back, um, and head back that way. So it doesn't look like he goes all the way into the rooms, unless he closes the doors behind him, which is possible. Come on, Bongo. I feel like I go over the strats every single time because I've, I've beaten this a lot. I've beaten, I've beaten hardcore a lot or hard. I keep calling it hardcore. I've beaten bongo hard mode a few times and every single time I'm like stumped on how to do it. I'm like, I have to reteach myself. Oh, I should have went earlier. Stay on the left. The door might save me. To the library. Fuck that room. I know my safe spot in the library. Don't let greed get me. In case he's coming. Are you coming, buddy? I still need four more, so there's most likely one in that room. In the fuck it room, as I call it. <clears throat> the room I don't like to go in, because Bongo loves to go in. He loves to go in there. There he comes. Just don't circle around, man. Okay. Let's make sure there are no bananas back here. No bananas. Um. Head into the fuck it room. No, no banana. Oh, there is one. Oh, come on. How how low of a percentage? Of chance is it for him to turn around like that on me in the fuck it room come on okay so I feel like either way we got to make it back to the main area 
I feel like going left first is the plan. I feel like that's the strat. Let's just go left first this time. Hit the fuck it room first. Yeah. It's fine. It's the strategy. It's gonna work eventually. It's called a YOLO strat. <clears throat> you just kind of run. You know, I could just leave the bananas at start till last. I don't have to grab these at all. God, the same corner banana is going to get me killed every time. He's there. Um, okay, I'm going to chill right here. Interesting. I don't think I've ever seen him spawn there before. <clears throat> There's a first time for everything, right? Banana and a cha, banana and a cha, banana and a cha, banana and a cha. Not that way. Alright, so from here, I'm waiting right here for him to come around. And we're gonna follow him out. Yep, <clears throat> that's the plan. Follow him out, then we're gonna go into that middle room. I'm gonna chill right there. I'm going to do the same strat I did before. <coughs> and um, it should work. should be fine. I feel like going the left side first is the just the better way. Because there's so, there's so many more mishaps that could happen over here. Mostly in the fuck it room. Because <laughs> a man could just turn around on a whim. Either that or he just moves so fast to where it's like, I don't know. It's craziness. Okay. Any day now, Bongo. I know for a fact, as soon as I go out there, as soon as I walk out, uh, he's going to be in that hallway, in my face. I know as soon as I make the decision, he's just going to be there. And there's there's really no other other safe place on this side of the map. He walks into every single room, even like the little closets. Come on, Bongo. Bongo, dude. Every other time. You come all up in here. What's going on? You need to talk. You need to talk to somebody. You can tell, tell somebody about your problems. What do you got going on, Bongo? Like, what's what's the real issue here? Why aren't you coming to the library? I, you know I'm here. Does he know what bananas are left and he's hanging around those bananas? No way Dave programmed AI like that, right? He's still just roaming around randomly. I'm just getting really unlucky. I'm calling shenanigans. Because he still roams around even if there's no bananas. Dave may have made his AI like that. Come on. Bongo! You can't do this to me. I have a strat. I have a surefire way to beat this. And you're not, you're not giving in. He's not giving in. Bongo just don't want it to happen. What's that over there? Like yellow shiny on the wall over there. <clears throat> Bongo, come on. Come on, please. I don't hear any of his footsteps. I don't want to move. I don't even want to go to the other side of the, uh, the library because I'm afraid as soon as I get up to move, he's going to come in because he moves so quick. I feel like I'll be able to hear him a lot better from the other side of the library. But, you know, risky. Because I'd have to move to the other side of the library. And I don't want to move at all. I don't want to lose anything. Bongo, come on, dude. Honestly, in this time, I could have just caught right back up. It did not take me long to get this far. God, half this winning run is just going to be me waiting in the library. Let's go. Going across. Okay, I can hear him. I think he's coming. 
Hard to tell. There's footsteps behind me going to the left. Okay, that's handy. That's useful. So now I can wait for his footsteps. To take him that way. I go this way. Let me in. Oh, left mouse button. Oh my god. I'm hit I'm sitting here hitting E. Oh my god. It's because I've been leaning. Alright, it's fine. I don't know where the last two bananas are, but that works! Okay, so now we know to wait on the other side of the library. <clears throat> hey, Bungo. So we wait on him to take a left. <coughs> Alright, Bungo. Not in there. Wait, so what two bananas am I missing? Because there's one here. Where's the last banana? Is it in one of the rooms on the right, on the way back? Probably. Watch me die. It's time to die. Nope. Alright, it's got to be in one of these rooms then. It's either in that one or in that one. So we got to wait for Bongo to go left again, check the rooms, come back. Mmm, banana. Ooh, banana. Banana, bongo, banana. Ooh, banana. Banana, banana. Alright, so we wait for Bongo to take a right. Or to go all the way that way. He needs to go all the way. So as soon as he passes that room, we are booking it to the exit, dude. Yep, that's the plan. Just gonna, we're just gonna make it happen. It's gonna be easy, right? Easy peasy. This whole game is so easy. Come on, Bongo. Come on, Bongo. He's hanging out in the library now. He's finally getting his much needed reading in. Left wall. Oh, I hope I don't get seen last minute. Staying left. And that's it. Unless he kills me in two seconds. Yeah. Don't expect that. No different. The ending is no different. All right, so let's go back to endless mode. And let's check it out one last time. See if I can get a better look at these mini bongos. <clears throat> They're so tiny. So my highest score in endless mode is nine. Beat that if you can. Sir? Oh, I forgot. There's like a big loop now. So where do the mini bongos spawn? Where do they start spawning over time? Like the more bananas you get. And oh, the library's closed. That's weird. So the map isn't just open now, it's like randomized. It's shut in some places. Which is very strange. I feel like I'm about to die. Yeah. He's so fast. He's about to catch me. Yeah. He's faster than you. He's faster than you. Uh, we'll try again. We'll give it like one more, one more good old tr oops. <laughs> so we've beaten normal and hard, but can we beat endless? Can you beat endless? Probably not, right? It's endless. It goes on forever. <clears throat> Whoa! You got to relearn the map first, I guess, because he changed the whole map on endless mode. Let's, you know what? <coughs> I'm bongo schmogload out. That's the end of this video. 
Bongo Smoglo new update. If you want to try it yourself, it's on Dave's Patreon. Link in the description. As always, this is a really good game. And he has... Whoa. He has tons and tons and tons of games on his Patreon. Like He's got like 20 plus games over there. And that's including games like Dave.exe with hours and hours and hours of gameplay. Um... Uh, uh, do me in the roomy also with hours of gameplay um, and like there's there's so many more uh, Dave.exe do me in the roomy prototype one are, th are the three big ones over there that are going to give you tons of gameplay and then you got all these little ones like bongo schmoglo or are the do ditter uh, you know um, or, or all of his paid games are free over there because you know it's patreon you're paying a patreon fee and vex clock is coming out soon it's gonna be on his patreon the dave the Dave, uh, the Dave, <laughs> the micro waifu simulator is a thing. I don't know if that's going to be on Patreon or not, but he's working on it and you'll get like updates and stuff on a lot of his, I don't know, man, go be a patron of Dave. It's definitely a hundred percent worth it. Like it, when I say be a patron to me, it's because I have 25 games over there, 25 downloadable posts on games. So I think it's like, and some of them are like trilogies and stuff. But I don't post new games very often over there. So when I say be a patron of Dave, I mean he's got tons and tons. And he keeps putting out tons and tons. And he keeps adding updates to his older games like this one. So yeah, try it out. It's worth it, dude. It's $5. That's, that's like nothing. And you, I mean, if, if it doesn't work for you, then you can always go back on your subscription. But patrons are really friendly with their with their buyers, you know. So anyway, Bongo Schmuglo, thanks for watching. You guys are awesome, and I love you so much. Hopefully I feel better soon, can get these videos back to normal. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. I love you.